Now hopefully you get some idea of the size and the depth of this uh, pond. This dog is actually called Antonia but I always refer to her as the Hund because she's German and she's still chasing the frogs in there. Now we actually have water not a lot at this moment because we had to dam off but water is eventually coming through this inlet pipe not as much as we would like but when we've finished over there with what we need to do I'm sure we'll get a really good flow of water and probably fill this very quickly and we'll put some grills on there to stop debris, rubbish, plastic bottles dead animals, you name it, what they dump coming into our pond and a nice grill on this end for the outlet so that our fish when we actually put fish in here will not be able to escape only the very tiniest of small fish so that's what you have very interesting project it's all on my land so I'm entitled to do what I'm doing I don't need any planning permission for it not that I asked about it and nobody's asking me any questions yet it's a bit late now because I'm not going to fill it back in again this soil will be moved to places where it's most needed and there's always places for soil on our land having so much of it agricultural land regulated land non-regulated land okay now the pipe is being covered over pushed the soil over the pipe so that's sealed and it should last my lifetime anyway that's the most important thing and for generations to come somebody will have a nice clean fresh water pool with some lilies in it and other oxygen giving and water cleaning plants and that's how you might say a legacy for future generations to enjoy okay guys and girls thank you for watching over and out bye